If you're still waiting for your passport weeks or months after applying, you're not alone. The backlog is getting longer as a record number of applications pour in. Fox's Jared Halperin has more from Capitol Hill. As the summer travel season heats up, the wait for passports is getting longer. More Americans are now finding their vacations in jeopardy as process time shoot up to 10 to 13 weeks. That is an increase from the 8 to 11 week wait reported back in February. Now lawmakers on Capitol Hill are asking the State Department to take action, including getting the online passport system working again. It's been shut down since earlier this year and is not scheduled to be back online until 2024. Virtually every other system in our country right now has an online system. We need to expedite that online system of passport renewal. The State Department says the backlog is partly due to the pandemic. Millions of Americans let their passports expire while they were isolating. And now, with travel picking up to pre-pandemic levels, more than half a million applications are being submitted every week. That is a new record, and it's forcing some families to get creative when it comes to finding an appointment at a passport office. The only appointment available, she was calling from Sacramento, was in Boston. So they flew to Boston. The State Department is now planning a series of of passport fares across the country to expedite the process. But in the meantime, lawmakers say Americans need to think ahead if they're planning a trip overseas. I think hope is on the way. That doesn't help you if you're planning on traveling in August. The passport fares are scheduled to end on August 30th, but they could be extended depending on demand. On Capitol Hill, Jared Halpern, Fox News.